Former U.S. National Security Advisor John Bolton has called for a far stronger response from Israel after Iran launched a mass missile and drone attack against the country. Bolton spoke exclusively to Weon to discuss possible scenarios if the tensions in West Asia boil over. He spoke to my colleague Mohammed Saleh. Watch. Iran has now threatened to use a never used before weapons if Israel decides to attack Iran again. Now, what weapons do you think Iran is referring to here when it says never before used weapons? Do you think Iran has crossed the nuclear threshold with which it is perhaps now threatening Israel? Uh, I don't I don't think they have nuclear weapons yet, but I do think, as your question implies, that the threat is to use nuclear weapons. And I think we should all be clear, always a lot of discussion, how quickly can Iran uh, manufacture a, a, a nuclear weapon? The, the answer is they don't need to manufacture it. They can buy it from North Korea uh, for whatever the, whatever price North Korea will try and extract from. So this is why Israel's decision uh, is is significant, not simply in response to Saturday's attack from Iran, but out of the legitimate concern that Israel has that the next time they see ballistic missiles uh, aimed at Israel from Iran, they have to worry that under the nose cones would be a, a nuclear device. So uh, I think what, they, what they're looking for is how to deter Iran from thinking about exactly the kind of threat you just mentioned. A lot of people are indicating that one of the targets that Israel could hit are Iran's nuclear sites. But, but the obvious counter to that is, it is, not, is it not evident that if Israel attacks Iranian nuclear sites, then Iran would hit back at Israel's nuclear site in Daimona in the Negev desert? Uh, well, look, this, this is one, uh, you're, you're right, this is one of ma many questions Israel has to ask itself. It has to worry whether it could face retaliation from Hezbollah in Lebanon with tens of thousands, some estimated 120,000 missiles that Hezbollah has. Uh, but on Saturday, uh, the Israeli government issued warnings to its civilian population in key areas and, and in and around big cities, Jerusalem, Tel Aviv, near many of Israel's military bases, but also to residents in and around Demona, where the reactor is. So we don't know, and obviously Israel doesn't say much about it, but it, it's, that's at least some indication that in Israel they perceive Demona to have been subject of, of the attack uh, on Saturday, apparently not successfully. But in other words, it may have been Iran that crossed the red line of attacking the nuclear program of Israel first. For all the latest news, download the Wion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.